Earlier this year, Samsung unveiled the Galaxy S23 series, featuring Qualcomm's Snapdragon processor as its exclusive powerhouse. However, it appears that Samsung is about to introduce a significant change with the Galaxy S23 FE edition. Contrary to its predecessors, the Galaxy S23 FE will utilize the Exynos 2200 chip in all markets, including the United States, the Exynos 2200, which previously powered the European variant of the Galaxy S22 series, will now also drive the performance of the Galaxy S23 FE, as per the information we have gathered. Notably, the Exynos 2200 was Samsung's first chip incorporating an AMD GPU, albeit being plagued by certain issues during its deployment. Possibly influencing Samsung's decision to partner with Qualcomm for the Galaxy S23 series, it is worth mentioning that by the time the Galaxy S23 FE is launched, the Exynos 2200 will have been in existence for nearly two years. Consequently, it is anticipated that Samsung has addressed the concerns experienced with the Galaxy S22 lineup, ensuring a smoother user experience this time around. This becomes particularly crucial if Samsung intends to employ the Exynos 2200 chip for the demanding US market, where customers and Samsung enthusiasts have long enjoyed the reliable performance of Snapdragon chips on their high-end Galaxy devices, while users in other regions have faced challenges with the increasingly problematic Exynos chips. Overall, it remains to be seen how Samsung will address the potential hurdles associated with utilizing the Exynos 2200 chip in the Galaxy S23 FA. As customers eagerly await the device's release, Samsung must strive to ensure that the Exynos 2200 delivers a seamless and satisfactory user experience, especially in the United States, where customers have become accustomed to the consistent performance offered by Snapdragon chips in their Galaxy smartphones.